or longer, higher, maybe add new and improved to the description of a span to replace the 74-year-old Gilmerton Bridge in Chesapeake. It's over the southern branch of the Elizabeth River connecting the South Norfolk and Deep Creek sections along South Military Highway. Ten of your sides, Ava Hurdle, talked with drivers today about starts, stops, and closures at the drawbridge. Ava. Nicole, drivers have not only had to contend with bridge openings, but several closings this summer to prepare for the arrival of the new lift span. Might be gone time they finish this bridge. Barry Boone jokes on his drive over the old Gilmerton Bridge from Chesapeake to Virginia Beach stopped during a bridge opening. I hate it. It's, it's, it's holding up everything. It's just, you know, it's tiresome to get in and out. You know, I'm ready to turn around now. More than 35,000 vehicles use the bridge daily. Nikki Copeland crosses it several times a day for work. What's the longest you've had to wait? Um, uh, 30 minutes maybe at a time. Yeah, probably about 30 minutes. And, and that's when we get to the point where we just say, you know, let's just go the other way. Travel lanes went from four to two lanes after construction to replace it started in November 2009. VDOT admits drivers will see less congestion next month after the lift span is installed at the new bridge, now under construction. We understand the driver's frustrations, but after Labor Day, the traffic will be traveling over the new bridge, not on the current bridge. The price tag on the project is $158 million. Completion is set for October 2013. The bridge already is closed weeknights, Sunday through Thursday, from 8 p.m. to 5 a.m., and it's set to close Friday, August 17th, beginning at 8 p.m., and reopening Monday, August 20th at 5 a.m. It will shut down for two weeks in September as construction continues. I'm Ava Hurdle, 10 on your side.